getting old blue all warmed up here ready for the day I've checked in already they know I'm here and uh, as soon as they begin loading it is 8 28 a.m. right now they start at 8 30 ish uh, whoever checked in first gets pulled in oh he's opening the gate right now so we call in the check-in that we're here and whoever calls in first I think gets to go in first I think that's how it works unless they have like a schedule of who because I don't really know whenever it's my turn I'm gonna go in there we're gonna load up some of these big old rolls again and head back down to Wapton North Dakota today's Thursday so we have tomorrow one more day and uh, then it's home for the weekend it's gonna make a little bit of room for them shoes on mark myself as here unloading cargo the guy unloading me is already in his skid steer so the faster I get my straps off this load the faster I'm empty the faster I run back for one last one this week yet Time is now, what is it? 20 to 3, so 20 minutes and everything was untied, rolled up, put away, and unloaded. Now I just got to write in my book here, my mileage and my load so I keep track of everything. And at the end of the month, I, uh, what do you call that again, where you 
compare and make sure that my notes and my records are the same as their notes and their records. Justify it, you gotta rectify it, you gotta reconcile it, that's it. End of the month, reconcile all my numbers with their numbers, right? Yeah, there's the working hat. And then there's the get out of the truck hat, or trucking hat, driving hat. One's clean, one's dirty, that's what I mean. The wind has been working against us all this week really bad. It's coming from the south blowing north, so when we're pulling our load, it's like a big sail behind us. Well, straight against wind all the way, all the way down here, but on the way up, that's where we get to benefit and sort of coast all the way up. But then we're empty. Forgive me for I have sinned, but it was so worth it. Let me explain. We're at Love's in Fargo. I came here for a reason, because yesterday we stopped here, we went to the Flying J, we went for our walk. It's just across the street over that way. And I looked across the street on the way back after my walk and I saw the golden arches. Oh, oh. Here I come, Oh, here I come. Oh. And I promised myself that since I went on my walk yesterday and my foot hurt so much, my foot's doing fine today by the way, I'm gonna give it another day's rest today though, just let that thing fully heal up, but anyway, at the end of my walk I said, you know what, tomorrow when we go through here, I'm getting myself a quarter pounder with a large fry, and I followed through, and I'm a man of my word, I promised myself but it was McDonald's, so I apologize. So the whole walk from yesterday was just so that I could have McDonald's today, and I still ate more calories than I than I burnt. But it was worth it. It was worth it. I, I wish I could eat McDonald's every day because I love it so much, I love their fries, but it is a special treat every now and then, and today was the day. And I'm a happy trucker right now. We're headed back empty with those pallets and that cardboard again today. Got one more load to do this week. One more rounder, also going down to Wapton. It's a nice run, I really like it. I really like it, I could do this for a while. I mean, eventually I'd wanna do something else, right? But, uh, so you'll see Flying J right over there. You'll recognize that from yesterday's video, I'm sure. And these are the golden arches I saw as I was walking back from over there. Saw the golden arches right here. I-21 northbound, also US-81. Sharing's caring, share a highway. Why build two highways when you can just build one? Don't change lanes in an intersection, I caught you. Well, technically it was after the intersection, but it was on a solid line. Careful, you don't wanna end up on YouTube. Interstate 29, I feel so good now. Sometimes I don't feel so good after I eat McDonald's, but today, that was a winner. I've been looking forward to that since this time yesterday. A full 24 hours, I've been thinking about it. I think it's been thinking about me too. It felt that way anyway. It felt pretty mutual. Oh, oh. Here I come, oh, here I come. <laughs> We 
survived another day. Isn't that great? It's good news. Good news. I got a warm bed back there. Good day. So it's uh, midnight. One minute to midnight. It is time to go to bed. So thanks for hanging out with me. My arms are itchy. It's probably this sweater. Weird. Sorry, I'm like itching myself like a monkey here. Just realized that. Whatever. I don't care. Still a good day. Still a good day. It's officially midnight. Happy Friday, everybody. So I can now say today we're going to start a new vlog. But later today, probably closer to 8 o'clock. I'll see you then. I hope you subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, all the other things that every other YouTuber always asks you to do. You know the drill. You've been watching YouTube for long enough. You know all the things that we beg you to do. Subscribe, like, comment, share. You know what? I'm just happy to have you here right now. Thanks for making it all the way to the end. I appreciate that. I really do. We'll see you in a few hours. Next vlog.